mate. I want to see this again. My god. What's good? Team Exclusive, welcome back to a brand new FIFA 22 video. Today, um, we are back with a brand new episode of our Create a Club Career Mode series. Back with episode number 11. Um, first things first, if you have missed any of the previous episodes and you want to check out the progression of the series, uh, I mean, there is quite a few episodes, so it might take you a while, but if you do want to, uh, feel free to check them out. They're all in a playlist. Um, but yeah, as you can see, we're in the Europa League. We're in the Championship in a really good position to win the... Uh, or get promoted to the Premier League sorry um, but I do have to address the elephant in the room now obviously if you've been watching the previous episode um, or there might have been a video between the last career mode and this one which obviously did kind of emphasize a big thing of which I'm going to talk about but yeah big sad big sad now if you don't want any spoilers check out the previous episode before I mention it otherwise here it is basically here it is so um, yeah we uh, we lost to Eddie and Ketia we lost Eddie and Kiddie. I was looking back at some of the previous episodes and realised how much I talked about him at the start of every episode. And it's a bit weird, a bit, it's a bit uh, fetishy. Um, so, uh, yeah, regardless, we lost Eddie and Ketia to Barcelona. Uh, that's the sad part. The good part is that we sold him for £200 million. Regardless, we sold Eddie and we built ourselves a really, really strong side. As you can see, obviously, we bought in um, Zachariah from uh, Mönchengladbach, we bought in Rainier from Dortmund, and we bought in Vinny J from uh, Real Madrid. And yeah, he's playing centre forward for us, and he's an absolute beast. The new partnership of Adiemi, who now is 87 rated, uh, and you look at those stats, like, like, wow, that's uh, how it is, and obviously that's all the ratings. But I do want to, as like I mentioned, we did obviously used to we start about talking about Eddie and Ketia. So I uh, transfer listed him just so we can keep <laughs> keep an eye on him. You know, have that weird kind of dad-like relationship. And there we are. As you can see, he's 90 rated. He's 90. Like, this dude is predicted to be 81 potential on every site. And he's 90 rated. Bruh. I mean, you just take a look at some of those stats. And that is just unheard. It's weird him being in a Barcelona kit. I'm not going to lie. It's pretty weird. But, I mean, he's got 96 pace. Like, 81 strength. What's his finishing? 93 ball control, 93 finishing. I mean, admittedly, we did build up, you know, 88% of that. But still, yeah, five-star, five-star. He's just he's just incredible. Like, 24 years of age, he is comparable to Mbappe now. I mean, obviously, Mbappe is 95, but he's 24. It's just, it's just crazy. What The question I've got is, you look at this, right? Obviously, Mbappe is slightly, uh, slightly higher rated, but who would you rather have? Either way, either way, we, uh, I've been playing a little bit in the background. Kind of shows how much I actually like this career mode. And uh, yeah, we've progressed through the group. So we've obviously played a few of the group games in the last episode. And um, yeah, we got up to the last one. So we've played all five. We've got 15 points. We've topped the group. And it wasn't very difficult because, I mean, the only hard team was OGC Nice. And we beat them pretty convincingly. Um, we could do Spar Sparta Prague a nice and uh, give them the win. And if we scored like seven own goals and uh, OGC Nice lost their next game against Op Opiel, uh, they could be out. <laughs> so we could really snake them if we did that, but we're not going to. We're not going to do that because most likely they won't. And who cares? Who cares? But we'll probably lose it because we oh, used my stronger team, didn't I? bollocks i was meant to use my weaker team to give these players a rest didn't do that we won the game anyway so we won all six that's good i guess that's good that's good um six million holy shit okay geez wow just for completing the group wow okay i mean i'll take it i will take it um yeah oh wow hold on hold on big developments Big development. So, it looked like Brighton has lost their previous game. So, we were on 50, uh, 49 points. They were on 51. Um, they obviously, you know, we, we obviously played our game. We won it. They played their game. They lost it. And now we're topping the table. Let's go. How the turn tables have turned. But, yeah, that's our team. 
So that's rocking it. We've got a huge team. Lego. Oh, that's Eddie Yemi away. There is no chance. And he scores the goal, man. Scores the goal. Gets us the goal. You love to see it. Adiemi, such a good player. He's a very... He's got kind of the Cavani story, hasn't he? Because uh, Cavani was a beast back in Napoli. And then he obviously joined... I think he joined PSG after that. I could be wrong. But he went to PSG anyway. And obviously Zlatan was there who kind of took the limelight. That was a shit pass. And uh, yeah, he never really got a chance to prove himself or progress that much. And I feel like Adiemi's been the same. Just with... Eddie and Ketia, you know, kind of stealing, stealing the show the entire time. But he's now the first team, first, you know, choice striker, isn't he? So he's uh, he's beasting. Let's a pass. And to Adiemi. And give it off to Vinny J. Gets the goal. Vinny Jr. becoming Vinny Senior. Let's go. Let's go. He needs to be number seven, doesn't he? VJ7. VJ7? KA7? No. Yeah, KA9 is good. But he needs to be VJ7. Let's go. What a strike, though, to be fair. <clears throat> what a strike. Bro, he lost the ball. He forgot the ball, man. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. Good job, Tavares. Uh... Okay. Okay. We got off lucky there, to be fair. Got off lucky. Oh, very lucky. <clears throat> Bring it with a good pass. Break right through to Adi Yemi. And a find guy in the middle. Vinny J. Oh, off the volley. Yo, if that had gone in, that'd have been one hell of a goal. Ain't gonna lie to you. It's got to be said, though, Vinny J is the next best thing. Like, I know Eddie and Ketty is the, the GOAT. He is. That's why he's the GOAT. But Vinny J is next level something else. Hey, yo, Chief, you got... Never mind. Watch this. Addy Yummy! Oh, it had so much potential. It had so much potential. But yeah, Vinny J is literally the next best thing. Still can't score a header. On Saka, you love to see it. Adiemi, what a goal! What a goal! Silky little pass from Vinny J. Adiemi with a banger. You love to see it. You love to see it. Adiemi feels like you know one of those pro club players or like your pro club player who just like is just nuts in every regard. <laughs> Look at this though. Bang. What a pass. And then what a strike. What a strike. And that calls the games. There's <laughs> no point playing the whole game. Really isn't. Really isn't. I don't know if it saves stamina or not. Wouldn't have thought so. But we, we battered them anyway. Absolutely battered them. So next game up against Bolton. So like I said, we are one point clear in the league. Again, it doesn't really matter too much about winning the league. Obviously, it would be quite nice. Um, I think... Chances are Brighton will probably shit the bed at some point. Um, yeah. So as long as we can keep kind of winning, we should be okay. But as long as we get top two, I'm quite happy with that, to be honest. I'm not too worried about actually winning the league. But it would be nice, though. It would be nice. See what we can do. Go on. Big win for the boys. Let's go. 3-1. Gabby gets the goal. Vinny J. And Ada Yemi. You love to see it. Who now is an 88-rated striker. Nuts. When will he stop? Never. We've got probably probably a half half strength side, which is absolutely fine. We're in the quarterfinals of the EFL Cup against Aston Villa. I wonder if we can have a look at the actual standing. Oh, okay. So obviously, yeah, we progressed through rank four, uh, round four, sorry, uh, against who did we play? Controller died. So we played, yeah, we played Leicester. That was actually a tough game. In all fairness, it was a really tough game. Um, but we did eventually beat them 2-1. Chelsea lost to Cambridge United 5-4 in penalties. Bit rough, that is. Bit rough, but yeah. Most likely Man City. I mean, Crystal Palace, possibly? I mean, Cambridge have been doing bits, so who knows. 
I mean, Norwich is probably going to beat Spurs, hopefully. Hopefully. But we're still going to beat Aston Villa first. So we'll see what happens. Pick up Richarlison. Boo. Suchek. Big John McGinn. Now we've got Martinez, Kabak, Martinez. Two Martinez's. Kadarabak. Nice. Good team. It's a good team. Good team. It's no exclusive FC, but it's a good team. Adiyemi. Adiyemi. Second bite of the cherry. Just can't quite uh, can't quite convert it. Come on, Saka. Big head. Bang. No. Still can't score a header. Oh dear. Wow. Okay. I, I don't quite know how that got on through, but uh, they have scored, so fair enough, I guess. Seba, come on. Big opportunity. Seba missed. Fuck me. Seba straight on through already. Come on, please score it this time. Let's go. All right. We may have played played part of this game. I got a little bit annoyed, okay? I got a little bit annoyed. So we'll, we'll, we'll try again. <laughs> we'll try again. I just can't be dealing with the AI sometimes. Like, it, it just seems like every time they take a shot, sometimes it doesn't matter what you do, they just score. I always find ways to get around your fucking defence and whatever. It's just it, garbage. Utter garbage. Great ball through to Adiemi. Come on. What is that? Why would he not just poke it with his foot? Bruh. Go on. Saka. Again. Saka. Saka. <laughs> the more times you say it, the more likely you are going to score. That's just how it works. I don't know how this game has turned out to be 2-0 for us, but something's changed. The AI... Dynamic difficulty or some... I swear, some fucking garbage, man. Like... Conspiracy theory. Some games you play, you play against a harder... Never mind, I'm not going to get into it. We did win 3-2. I couldn't be bothered to play against them again. Probably should have, to be honest, because that was a cup game, wasn't it? Whatever. We won the game, so it doesn't matter. It's close, though. It's very close. It's very close and that was risky. Regardless, we we beat Aston Villa 3-2 in the Carabao Cup. Things you love to see. I don't really understand what happened there. But yeah, so next game against Birmingham City. It should be, hopefully, fingers crossed to win. Come on. 2-0. You love to see it. Getting into a bit of a rhythm now. Got a, got a good team. Got, got some good tactics. Good formation. You know, it seems to actually be doing really, really well for us. All right. So I'm going to save the game there. I'm always a little bit scared jumping forwards now, just in case, like, somebody, you know, like, Real Madrid comes in for Adiemi and just buys him immediately. So I've kind of been traumatised a little bit. <laughs> kind of been traumatised, but it's fine. Um, I'm going to simulate up until our next couple of games which is against Tottenham, apparently. Christ, okay. Um, yeah, get through that game. 3-0 win. You love to see it. Just going to try and simulate majority of the season because uh, who cares well it is now our job to knock Spurs out can't wait so have a look at their team though before we start so they got big boy Kane Ali Boga Rodriguez I wonder if that's Hammers. they got Doherty Paulista Dyer El Karun I have no idea Loris Skip Pedri Pedri from Barcelona, interesting. That's actually a really good signing. And uh, Deli Elia, I mean, it's a good signing. Unfortunately, Spurs bought him, so it's, he's going to end his career there. It's a great ball, great ball, slow defenders. Quickie, quickie striker, bang. Let's go. Adiemi, 1 0 to exclusive FC, 0 to Spurs. Vinny J away. It's Vinny J away. Vinny J, bang, gets us the second goal. You love to see it. Get fucked, Spurs. I mean, the thing is, they're actually quite dangerous. Uh, it just wipes out his player. Um, they're actually quite dangerous on the attack. Obviously, they've got big boy Hainald, Uh But, like, their defence is just is just utter shambolic. Utterly shambolic. That's a great block. Three times I blocked that, but it's fine. Didn't really want to get the ball anyway. I knew, I knew I did that as well. As soon as I did it, I knew it. 
Great save though, yes, sir. Three for three right now. Three for three. You love to see it. Great tackle by Balde. Make the run. Got the got the pass on, please. Vinny J. Vinny J. Always. Never gonna miss, is he? It's never gonna miss. It's Vinny J. Let's go. My boy. Makes it 3-0. Get fuck Spurs. Vinny J away again. Got a runner at the back stick. Bang! I think he's offside and he is. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. <laughs> Unfortunate. We've got three minutes though. Maybe we could uh, possibly get another one. Whatever. Shit house time. And bomb. There you go. Game over. <laughs> Game over. Let's go. That was actually a really easy game to play. I mean, I say that, but it was actually very difficult. Um, like, you know, they played well, to be honest. They just, um, they just, they just didn't score. They just did not score a goal, and we, uh, we actually battered them. But in all, in all seriousness, even though, like, you know, they're a Premier League side, our team isn't bad. We've got some like. I don't know. We've got, some, we've got some really good players. Like, Adiemi is, is almost one of the world's best at this stage. And they had Harold Kane. So, puts in puts you in some perspective anyway. Right, so, round three against Morecambe. Uh, what are we saying? So, they've got McDonald, Wildig, McLaughlin, Dixon, O'Connor, Lay, Cooney, Connie, Harrison. I have literally no idea. But, like I say, we do need to win this. Should be fairly simple. I mean, we beat Spurs, but I mean, anybody can beat Spurs, can't they? Oh, chill out! What the fuck is going on? He's got a red card, man. It just, it just, it always goes to shambles immediately. There's just no like, there's no zero. Oh god. Fine. What's th this game is this game is a mess. My god. Okay. Nice, thank you, Tavares. They've scored, brilliant. All because Tavares won the header, look at this, and passed it straight into the path of the attacker. Like, unreal, man. They've actually scored again. Unreal, man. Unreal what's going on at this current stage. I can't believe it. It's a good pass. There you go. Okay, one back, come on. Jesus. We're not going to lose this game, it's fine. We're definitely going to win this. I mean, if we don't, I'll just restart the game. <laughs> no, if we, if we don't win it, we don't win it. I'm not going to restart the game, but we will. There's no there's no way I'm doubtful we'll lose this game. Tavares on the run. Got some pace on him. So does Adiemi, who is free in space. Takes a touch. Bang. It's not going to miss, is he? Who to? They... Ugh. I can't believe they even scored two, to be honest. Actually absurd. It's a good pass, actually. Seb with an excellent pass. Straight on through. Bang. 3-2. You love to see it. So a good pass on side. Hutchinson with a great goal. That is things you love to see. What a guy. What a guy. This, this Hutchinson, I think he's only like 18. And he is only like, I think he's 74 rated. But he's so good. So good. And he's he's one of the originals of the exclusive FC as well. Um, I think he came with the club. Same with Charles, who's a bit sad, but I don't give a fuck. He's a bit of an ass now, so in the piss. You get there. Go on. Nice. Watch this. Ping. Ooh! <laughs> Hutchinson. What? Wait. <laughs> I want to see this again. My God, my God, Hutchinson with an absolute banger. That's insane. That's insane. That's insane. Wow. wow. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I've said that so many times. And I've, it's just never, it's never gone in. Now, Jesus. Okay. Oh dear. <laughs> uh, um okay uh, okay <laughs> okay okay I mean I mean wow 
Holy shit. What a goal, man. He's fuming. I'm fuming. We're all fuming. Holy shit, what a goal. I can't even believe he did that. That's nuts. This game has had some absolute rippers in them. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. Hutchinson with a with a long range worldy. Whatever that guy's name was. Morecambe with an absolute worldy as well. First time by Simmons. <laughs> if only. Good save, I suppose. Come on. Big head. Score your first header. Let's go. <laughs> We finally scored a header. Let's go. You love to see it. You love to see it. I actually don't know who that was. Castillo Jr. Bang. Great heads. Let's go. 6-3. What a game. Unreal. Well, that, that will be game over. 6-3 against Morecambe. I want to say Morecambe United, but probably not. Just Morecambe. Is it Morecambe? I don't know. To be honest. 6-3. What a game, though. What a game. It was this one, wasn't it? It's after a Hutchinson goal. Gets it and just pings it. Unreal. I've never seen an AI score a goal quite that good before. That's insane. That's nuts. But there you go. Wow. What a goal by Seba. Wasn't really... Planning on doing any commentary on this game because I just want to get through it. It's a pointless, needless game. What a goal. Absolute banger. My god. Seba. Jesus Christ. He is only 20 though. I can't. No, I can't. I was gonna tempt I was gonna be tempted to leave it up to like viewer suggestion, but no, I'm gonna I'm gonna say no because he is only 20. I think you can see the last one, 17.9 million was from uh the league and team and uh back then i was saying oh no he, there's no point accepting it because he's like he's 18 he's you know he's upcoming talent he's going to be so much more expensive and now he's at the point where he's so much more expensive it's like he's going to be even more <laughs> he's going to be even more like think when he's 25 he's going to be what 83 84 rated probably my prediction and i think he's going to be worth close to 100 mil probably easy going to be one of the best left backs in the game easy all right yeah so that's how the team's going to look we're going to basically play our full th full strength side saka zakaria simmons rainier bolde uh adiemi and vinnie j against uh, spurs united so yeah it's three nil i mean like if if we can score a goal or two we'll, we'll call it there we'll call it a day um because i don't think they would come back from like four or five nil down I'm willing to be proven wrong, but I don't think they would. Oh, Vinny J. Vinny J's in. Kills the game. 4 0. You love to see it. Let's go. Great goal. Great bit of play. Great interception by uh, uh, Liners. And a uh, great pass on through as well. Things you love to see. A great pass. A great pass. Adiemi finishes it off. Let's go. I'm done. Spurs is done. I just want to see if they actually scored. No, they didn't even score a goal. Brewer, terrified. Every single time, terrified. Anyway, we are going to simulate up until that game. Uh, and just before the City game. A draw. That's not ideal. Not ideal. Come on, big win. We lost. Wow. We won. Okay. Gonna make things interesting anyway i guess it's gonna make things interesting anyway we've got blackburn rovers so brighton are two points clear of us in the league at the minute which is not ideal but again like i say i don't think it matters too much second place will get promoted anyway um so as long as we can you know as long as we can keep second first it doesn't bother me too much like i say obviously it would be nice um but Wow, 4 1. God, Saka, Seba, Vinny J, and Bolde all getting a goal. Yeah, so we're up to that point where it's almost the end of the season. Um, 
we are going to leave it there for today. We obviously are going to play the, as you can see, the final against Manchester Manchester City against exclusive FC. It's going to be it's going to be an interesting game. I'd be interested to see who what kind of players they've got because obviously it is 2024, so it is a good few numbers, a few years in the future. Um, yeah, so we're going to play that next episode, and obviously we'll we'll complete the season. Hopefully. Fingers crossed, we'll uh, finish in either first or second place and get promoted to the Premier League, which is just going to be insane. And then we'll have a whole new round of transfers, probably, um, which will be insane. It'll be crazy. But yeah, loving it. I'm, I'm really enjoying this career mode so far. Hopefully, you're enjoying the series. Um, yeah, I'm having a lot of fun. Really, really enjoying it. So like I always say, if you did enjoy this uh, video, please do drop it a like. And if you're enjoying the series and you want to see more of this content, please do subscribe to the channel, become part of the exclusive family. But with that said, I do hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching and as always, we'll see you next time.